Division of Wildlife Resources is looking to change the way harmful quagga mussels are cleared from boats at Lake Powell. It's all thanks in part to two boaters who wanted to find a way to shorten the lines and make it easier on workers. The specialist Mike Anderson now with a look at how this whole thing works. Yeah, Mike, you know those uh, quagga mussels are a big problem out at uh, Lake Powell, so of course we don't want them in our waters around the state. But the DWR says with a new uh, dip tank, they can clean more boats faster. With a heater and a tank of water, wakeboard boats like this one can get decontaminated with a simple running of the ballast system. To see it actually built and working is pretty exciting and very satisfying. Yeah, to go from essentially a napkin drawing to what you see behind us is, is pretty rewarding. Garrett Atwood and Jonas Haita have spent many Lake Powell trips together and have grown familiar with the lines that can build as boaters are looking to leave. A week plus and, and you leave the lake, the last thing you want to do is sit in the long line and decontaminate your boat. You know, kids crying, you know, wife telling you, let's leave. <laughs> That's a problem for the DWR, too. The current system can take about 30 minutes and lines can build fast. They ideally don't want boaters leaving before getting decontaminated. So as that has continued to increase every year, the urgency to put a system like this in the ground there to serve the boaters of Utah, uh, it increased and it, it forced us to innovate. Nathan Owens, Aquatic Invasive Species Coordinator for the DWR, says he'd talked about a similar tank system before, but when Atwood and Haita came along with the same idea and the means to get it done. And I knew once I saw that, that we were going to be able to make this happen. And here it is, water at 110 degrees getting pumped through, helping keep this stuff from getting around the state. To be able to help stop that from spreading throughout Utah, it is, I, I'm really proud to be able to help them. Yeah, in addition to the hot water, there's also a couple of uh, filters that help clear out the quagga before in between boats. And that uh, dip tank system will be used down at the state line uh, boat launch there starting May 1st. Back to you. Yeah, what a great idea. I'm anxious to see how it works out. Mike, great story. Thank you.